Oh, pretty. Oh, so pretty. bombshells as you can tell by the title of this video I'm going to show you some of my favorite reds they're at all different price points and they're in different categories I have some drugstore I have some high-end I have some in between so without further ado let's get into it so before we start do you see my little top with my little red lips on it how the fitting right so the first lipstick I have is uh, a drugstore lipstick. This is by Flower Beauty. This is in the color Azalea. Now this is a pretty, just vibrant, classic kind of blue red. And blue red's usually my favorite for my skin tone. So let's apply this. Oh, pretty. Oh, so pretty. So this is a vibrant red, a natural matte. Um, it's, it's a very comfortable matte. And that's another thing I like. I like natural matte reds. And this is just a pretty red drugstore. Great pigment. And feels great. Love this red. Also a good tip for taking off mattes and uh, lip stains and uh, lip, you can use a makeup wipe, but you also can use oil too to get the last traces of it off. That also works. When you're wearing red lipsticks or highly pigment lipsticks, make sure that you um, do a lip scrub and also a good lip deep condition that way the makeup uh, or the lipstick applies better and it won't peel as much this is an iman cosmetics matte lipstick and vice this is another red i really like i think it's kind of a classic red it's not as blue red as some others it's to me a little bit more neutral or yellow base but again a very comfortable matte formula and a very vibrant red to me this is a vibrant classic red a little bit more yellow based but it's so complimentary to my skin tone it's a natural matte it's comfortable to wear and for me lipstick comfortability is a must because I have as you can see I have full lips Hashtag no fillers. Hashtag they are naturally big. Okay. <laughs> so I'm very picky about lipstick and lip formulas. But I really love this because it's just a classic vibrant red. The next red I have is from Bare Minerals. This is their Bare Pro lip line. It's highly pigmented. It's also a natural matte formula. Very comfortable to wear. And for me, the Bare Minerals Bare Pro. Pro line period like even their foundations they are to me more full of coverage more pigmented because I think as a whole the brand is known for kind of like everyday makeup or skin like makeup but if you may be like a makeup artist and you need like a full of coverage or it's your wedding day or you're taking pictures I would definitely recommend their bare pro lipstick line because it's again it's comfortable enough to wear all day but it's highly pigmented enough to last all day and this is in the color cherry I will say out of all the formulas this is the one that kind of slides on the easiest and feels the most slick for lack of a better word but it still has like a natural to me this is like a satin matte and that's probably why the glide is so uh, smooth on this one
So next I have a lip, a liquid lipstick. Now to be honest, I really don't wear a lot of liquid lipsticks. I'm either just a gloss or a traditional bullet type lipstick girl. But when I saw this color, I was just immediately drawn to it. This is probably the maddest formula out of all of them. Girl, let me get on the inside of my lip. Girl, she's mad. I usually don't gravitate towards liquid lipsticks, but I think this is a great option for those who do. I usually tend to um, use the traditional lipsticks and the lipstick uh, bullet, but when I saw this color, and I know that liquid lipsticks do last a long time, and these had good uh, reviews on it. Girl, and it's a black owned business, hashtag mm, support. Uh, I definitely wanted to try this one, so I think this is a beautiful red. It's still drying down. I don't think I'm gonna let it dry down all the way because I feel like if I do, this won't come off my lips. But again, Beauty Bakery, Mon Cherie Lip Whip. Girl, cause she ain't coming off. And for the final red lipstick, this is a cult favorite. This is Max Ruby Woo, I mean, if you haven't heard of this lipstick then where have you been under a rock it is their retro matte it is also a very dry formula girl my lips are going through honey matter of fact let me apply some oil um and this is argan oil just to kind of rejuvenate it and then i'll wipe it off but girl that beauty bakery lip whip when i say it did not buzz and not want to come off. I would probably say out of all the formulas, that beauty, the Beauty Bakery one is the, probably the longest lasting. Because it literally created a shield on my lips. <laughs> like, I just feel like they would, it's 24 hour wear. Let's go in with Max Ruby Woo. Mm. It's so funny because I always felt like Max Ruby Woo was a drying formula or like a dry down to your lip formula. But after the lip whip, <laughs> I don't even feel it dry. Girl, that lip whip, when I say it is a lip tattoo, okay? Girl, Ruby Woo, again, is a very vibrant blue-red. I've seen this on several different skin tones to fair, tan, uh, my skin complexion even deeper than mine. And this is always a complimentary red, no matter what your skin tone is now I don't even have a lot of MAC products their foundation actually breaks me out but this girl this is this is probably the only MAC product I have oh and their their lip liners uh I, yeah I have their lip liners and their lipsticks but again a classic red a cult favorite I think everybody in their auntie's grandma's mother has ruby woo and uh, rightfully so because this is a very pretty classic retro when you think of like the 50s 60s that classic red you know va va boom um kind of a bombshell look you think of a red lipstick and this is that i think this is a timeless red complements all skin tones again this is if you if you're if you are apprehensive about trying a red lipstick girl just get Ruby Woo and you can't go wrong. Well, bombshells, thank you so much for tuning in. Those are some of my favorite red lipsticks. Comment below and let me know what are yours. Girl, I'm always on the hunt for a fire red lipstick. Emphasis on fire, emphasis on red. Um, also, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Also, follow me on my Instagram where I share more tips on hair, 
beauty and even my life as a plus size model in fashion as well so thank you so much for watching happy holidays to you and your family and enjoy your day and stay safe